Hey guys, this is John from the Reaper blog, bringing you another tutorial video. Today I'm going to talk about uh, Touch OSC. That's a iPhone app or iPad app that lets you uh, remotely control your DIW. And it's pretty cool. So this video will show you how to set it up with Reaper. So first you need to get yourself Touch OSC. Have a search through the iTunes app store, then you can download it drag it onto your iPhone. The app only costs $4.99 and I think it's well worth it. Once you have Touch OSC running on your iPhone, uh, you need to go into the settings, click on OSC, enable it, and then here you see the IP that you're going to connect to, outgoing and incoming ports, and the IP address of this device. Switching over to Reaper, and we open the preferences, come down the list to control surfaces. Click on add. The type we're going to select OSC. Device name, we'll just call it iPhone. We're going to select the logic touch pattern. Receive on port 8000 and host IP. Um, this is where you get the number that you type in right here. Then you want to send to the other device. So port 9000 and we just type in the IP of this device. Now we can click OK. And on the iPhone, there's one more thing we have to check. Click on Layout, and then select Logic Touch. Now on the iPhone, we've got this control surface. We can scroll through the tracks like this. It's automatically got the track name, which is really nice. You can see the the fader level here, um, automation, panning, uh, record, input monitor, solo, mute. We also have the global uh, cycle, record, stop, and play. And it works just like that. We can scrub. Uh, let's see, let's grab the, the overheads. Hit play. And that's pretty much it. Uh, with this logic control template, uh, the EQ section doesn't work because that's made for, um, uh, I guess it's made for logic. And um, there is a, a custom one for Reaper, but it doesn't seem to be working for me at least. But as far as setting it up, it's pretty much that simple. Just set input and output ports, set the IP. The two devices are connected through Wi-Fi, so it was literally that easy. All right, well, I hope this helps, and uh, have fun. Stay tuned for more videos and tutorials at reaperblog.net.